Some Cass County homeowners could soon be flying high. A proposed subdivision would include the area's longest paved private runway. For now, those plans are temporarily grounded, but not everybody's a fan of this idea. Fox 4's Dave DeMarco live at the Cass County Commission, where some neighbors voiced their concerns tonight. Dave? Uh, Lauren, this was a special use permit for a private septic system, sewer, all underground, of course. But neighbors we spoke to a little more concerned with what might be going overhead. Peggy Bruce describes her Cass County neighborhood near 195th and Prospect as... Very tranquil, very quiet, very family-oriented. Um, and I see airplanes flying over as a real um, impediment to that both from the noise pollution standpoint, from the health to our kids. She and other neighbors are concerned about planes because of a proposed 159-acre Arrowhead Air Park planned on farmland across the street currently zoned agricultural. I didn't buy our house to live by an air, airport, so that's our major concern is, is why are we putting an airport out at 200th and Prospect. At a meeting tonight, the developer said it would have 94 homes and a 3,000 foot paved runway. It'll have home sites where pilot owners uh, can live in their homes and have uh, the luxury of flying right out of their, their front door, basically. Here's 100 houses plopped down on 150 acres in the middle of agricultural, rural, multi acre properties around it and trying to, like, invent suburbia out in the middle of rural America. And that feels like a misfit in so many different ways. Wilcox says not all the planes will regularly be flying, but there's a lot of plane owners on waiting lists for hangar space who want to be able to park their planes at their homes. A lot of it is just the enjoyment of uh, like-minded residents who love airplanes. Well, tonight's septic utility discussion might not have all the details neighbors are looking for. Air park developers promise they're coming. We hope that this is uh, the first step to uh, more applications, more public hearings, and then we'll uh, have a lot more detail on how we'll develop the air park and, and run the flight operations. Wilcox told me he really hopes to be begin building later this year. As you heard him mention there, a lot of approvals ahead. And Lauren, with this continuation tonight, we'll have to see how that impacts things. Thank you, Dave. Dave DeMarco in Cass County tonight.